Hello, my name's Leanne Elliott, Consultant Radiologist and Deputy Chief Medical Officer at Bradford Teaching Hospitals NHS Trust. As part of Worldwide Antibiotic Awareness Week 2019, our staff are highlighting the importance of antimicrobial stewardship. We know worldwide that microbial resistance is a huge problem for all of our population. All of the consultants in Bradford, from neonatologists to care of the elderly physicians, are aware of the importance of using antimicrobial treatment responsibly to try and improve this problem. What does antimicrobial stewardship mean to me? It means prescribing the correct antibiotic for a patient based on their clinical scenario and taking into account local guidelines. And as well as that, it's important that we review the choice of antibiotic on a promptly and on a regular basis based on culture results and blood tests, but also on clinical improvement. It's important that we ask whether an antibiotic is necessary at all and that we think about the duration of antibiotics. In the neonatal unit we use a lot of antibiotics and for, for me antimicrobial stewardship is about using antibiotics early um, so that patients can reap maximal benefits but stopping them when they're not necessary as we usually are able to do at 36 hours um, after, uh, after a baby's born. We use narrow spectrum antibiotics, typically penicillin and gentamicin, and for late on, query late onset infection, we use a particular um, combination of antibiotics targeted at the narrowest possible focus. And we try to be rigorous about stopping antibiotics because of the evidence of clinical benefit to our patients. There's a side benefit of, of benefit to the wider population. Hello, my name's Sam Khan. I'm the clinical director for Urgent Care. Um, antibiotic stewardship is a massively important part of what we do in urgent care because we're the first port of call for the septic patient or the presumedly septic patient um, and we have a clinical responsibility across the whole of our clinical workforce to make sure that the patient is appropriately assessed and that includes your new score, your parameters but then the appropriate cultures are sent off before we even start to consider what the likely infection is and then choosing an appropriate antibiotic as per our local guidelines. My name's Matthew Mathai and I'm a consultant paediatrician working at the BRI. This week I'm on take in our short stay unit. We have a number of children who come in every day with infectious diseases. For me, antimicrobial stewardship is about best patient outcomes. I have to make a decision whether a child needs antibiotics and if they do, what type of antibiotics and the duration. Getting the right antibiotic is really important because it reduces the risk of resistance and cost to the families and cost to the NHS. Antimicrobial stewardship is a key priority for our organisation and we feel that a collaborative multidisciplinary approach is vital for delivering this objective. From the ward pharmacist to the nursing staff, from the scientists in the lab to the consultant microbiologists, we all have a key role in delivering antimicrobial stewardship for our patients.